Hey, welcome to my channel. I'm Serge from Sister Safan. So today my uh, premium connectivity expired and so uh, we're going to be looking at uh, how to renew it and if it's worth it and basically uh, what's included and finally uh, we'll conclude and see if uh, I recommend it or not. All right, let's get into it. Okay, so I'm in the app now and I'm going to uh, click here on manage uh, on the car so uh, that'll bring us uh, to the details of the car so let's just wait for this to load okay now I see here it's still loading I can see my car and what I'm gonna do now is click on the details up here and uh, you can see here all the details on the bottom here you can also see the upgrade so I'm gonna click on upgrade for the standard connectivity because I've fallen back to that and uh, that didn't work so let's see if we can do it again all right uh, so i'm going to click down here in the upgrade button okay here we go so now it brings me to the uh, review subscription so i can see here all the stuff that's in there i have my payment that i'm hiding you can see the details of uh, the connectivity packages so i'm falling back to standard and i want to go back up to premium so I can review here, you can see, so all the stuff with a little star means that you can get it over Wi-Fi, uh, but you cannot get it over uh, the net. I mean the GSM network, of course. Um, so, uh, but it means that navigation, live traffic, visualization, satellite views, you will never get over Wi-Fi. Uh, it's only in the premium package. All right, so uh, let's uh, do the purchase now. So here I'm going to click on the big uh, purchase button down here once all my payment information is up to date, which I've done previously. And now we're just waiting. And the payment's gone through and now it tells me it will um, renew on a specific date and renew monthly. Uh, so uh, now uh, we can, next step is that we can go back to the car and see if everything went well. So I'm going to uh, get out of the app now and I'm going to check in the car if anything well. So now we can see here uh, that in the car everything is ready. All right, so as we saw, uh, the process was not too involved and uh, it's available almost immediately, which uh, is good because they say, please wait a minute, uh, a few minutes for it to, to work. Um, so the big question is, is it worth it? Well, here, um, my experience has been okay. But I heard that some people say that with the Wi-Fi connection, they have less problems. But the problem with Wi-Fi is that you have to either always set up your phone as a hotspot and remember to turn back on the Wi-Fi once you put the car in drive. Um, you know, I'm the kind of person that it's going to annoy pretty quickly to do that. And I think the price is not ideal, but I get value out of it. Um, I especially like to be able to watch YouTube videos when I'm waiting for someone or something like that. So uh, yeah, I'm, I would recommend it for people like me who uh, would like the fact that everything's integrated into the car, don't, don't have to use something different. The only thing I wish is uh, if you're paying this money, um, you should be able to get all the car updates directly off the connection. Uh, right now it still requires Wi-Fi connection which I think is a little bit cheap from Tesla. They could include that um, in, the, um, in the package, the premium connectivity package. All right, that's it for this video. I hope you liked it. Uh, if you did, make sure to put a thumbs up and uh, hit the subscribe, subscribe button and notification bell to get notified when I release my next video. Of course, if you'd like to purchase one of these cars, I still highly recommend it after a year. Um, you definitely should use a referral code. You'll get uh, free supercharger electricity uh, and so will I if you use my referral code that I put in the description below. All right, uh, th that's it for this video. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.